So today Chelsea and I will be, there's Chelsea. We will be deconstructing this motorhome. This 1978, I think it's a 78 Vogue motorhome. And I'm trying to determine what is holding the sides on by taking all these trim pieces off. These are, these are some of the big bolts, screws, that I'm sure are holding it together. One thing I like about this motorhome, the walls are, they're solid. There's no rot in any of the walls. I mean, you can push on them and they're solid. You can hit the side and the windows don't all rattle and shake. They're sealed up really good. And I like that it's smooth fiberglass. That helps a lot. So it's going to take a little redesigning of the frame on the on the habitation, but I think it's going to be worth it. It's not going to set me back too far, hopefully. Plus, this just looks cool with those slopey windows. So a little bit of the Vogue will live on, and this. I'm going to try to put this whole back cap on it. That's a one piece all the way up from that strip up there, about right above the lights. That's all one piece and it wraps around. So I'm going to try to put that on. It has all this cool stuff on it from where it was originally bought in Texarkana. And this window opens, which is a cool feature. <laughs> no, the door window is your favorite. <laughs> Chelsea said that the door window is her favorite. Nice little circle. And that back window is her second favorite. So, lots of cool stuff on here. And, of course, the coolest of it all was the 12-valve the Cummins that I got that somebody paid me $400 to take. And it runs. So... That will be a project all on itself. So today we're gonna get busy deconstructing the motorhome. <laughs> Getting this motor home is causing us to rethink our plans a little bit. We gotta modify the plans for the camper to habitation box on the truck a little bit. But it's gonna be for the better, I think. And I took the back cap of it off. Didn't get that on camera, of course. But I'm gonna use this whole back cap on the camper so that's gonna solve a lot of thinking and planning plus make it look better I think and that's what the back of it looks like with the cap off
finished deconstructing that old Vogue. And there was a little bit more rot in the walls than what I expected to find, but it's okay. Um, these are the last of the videos that you'll see of deconstruction and starting with my next uploads, it will all be building. But I've got to cut a bunch of these um, one and a half. I think they're one and a half by one and a half boards. So I'm going to cut these, uh, rip these out of some two by fours. You can see it's all rotted on the end. I'm going to get those edited and uploaded. And you can see how we got a floor. I'll give you a sneak peek real quick. There's the other wall that I'm working on. I'll give you a sneak peek real quick. This is the entryway. And there's a drain. There's going to be a shower in this entryway. It's going to be double duty as an entryway and a shower. So that's going to be cool. Thanks for watching my videos. Please be sure to subscribe and like the video if you liked it. Click a thumbs down if you didn't like it. And drop a comment down in this comment section below. It'd be cool.